Yo, 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 what's good, what's good, what's good? It's the Hard Food Podcast. Back again. Back again. Loved it. My name's Juice English. And this is episode three. Three. Of the Hardest Food Podcast. Hardest food. Make sure you subscribe. Follow Instagram. TikTok. I ain't got the TikTok. Threads. Right You're on the TikTok. We want threads though. Right? High five. I don't think we threaded anything. High five. Like from back in the day. Mm. Oh, I don't remember that five, one still. Know. MySpace. Yeah, it was like MySpace before MySpace though. Oh, yeah. so dumb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Only fans. Oh, that's true. We need to get that yeah. one soon. For sure. High five. But for the time being, subscribe to YouTube. That's the main important one. Yeah, yeah, do that, do YouTube. that, do that, do that. Get on there, get the numbers up. Instagram. Subscribe now. Follow. It's an almost X, remember? Mine's still Twitter still. Mine's still Twitter. I haven't updated. It, swear, I got yeah. auto updates on that. No, Can I reverse never that? that? Never that. X is too serious, man. It's just no, black and... Yeah, it's a bit much. Like, X, it. yeah, it's like intense. Like bad. Elon, don't try and switch up my thing either, fam. Uh, it's actually intense. Like, everyone's just trying to shit. It's like, oh, we should be like... Anyway, uh, Timbo Slice in the building. Yeah, yeah. DJ in the building. Oh, go on. Saxon King in the building. <laughs> 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 Someone could say juice, okay, juice, juice in English the building. In the building. Yeah. Hey, hey guys! What's wrong with this? I made it. I want to. What are we saying? What's so everyone saying? Today. What are you saying? You you start. You start. You, Me? you start. You start. Go go go, go go go. What I'm doing? The joke is, yeah, I'm actually having. I should be upset. My car's broke down. Yeah, I've, I've had it for oh. three months. We need to have a bike tonight because that would have been. A, oh. oh no, no, yeah. we need to get the the yeah, the. the yeah, yeah, yeah. Soundbite. But yeah, my car broke down, man. So I've just been passenger princessing all week. Yeah. Damn, yeah, not yeah. passenger prince. Is that a thing? It sounds too sassy. Are you a princess? I mean, you can be. It's 2023. I mean, I'm just like... You know, that's, just what, as one. that's just what people say, isn't it? You know, I'm not actually a princess. No, passenger prince. Eh? You identify as a princess. I just said identify as me. You identify as a princess. In, I didn't, I, no, I'm not a princess. So I don't okay. identify as a princess. I okay. identify as me. Just juice, isn't it? I'm a juice. I'm a, you're a juice. I'm a juice. Yeah. Okay. A princess juice. No, that just sounds <laughs> weird. But yeah, I'm actually, despite, despite the inconvenience, I'm actually in a really good mood this week. So, so good. Love so that. gravy right now. So good. Mm. Love yeah. What about you? How's your week? Um. We sang that song. Not too long though. Like the Lion King it's, thing was a bit over. Romeo and uh, Christina Romeo Millian. Christine Millian. Yeah. It's all gravy. Um. Uh, I'm not too bad, you know, usual, was trying to sort out this stupid party for myself, Jeez. but, um, you know, better drama with that. Just cancel it? And, nah, it's not getting cancelled, it's going on. And Saxon King party. Basically. You invite on the listeners? No. <laughs> um, <laughs> invite only. Yeah. Oh. And, you know, sorting it out. There's lots of things to do for it, and just want it to be like, you know. Yeah, of course, man. Of course. Yeah, of course. Me correct, too. I want yeah. it to be a good event. Step, so. step correct. I'm talking like dress to impress. Yeah, I'm impressed. Shirt and tie business. I mean. Oh, wait. Is it shirt and tie? I'm not going to say shirt and tie. Oh, you're saying like literally. But I'm saying you have to look like, you know, you have to come nice. Somebody yeah. picked me if you look like. I mean. Can I wear this? <laughs> Damn. No. You know what? You know what? No gas, yeah? I kind of like. Wait, we're hating on my outfit, though, man. What? We're hating on the fit. I'm not hating on your fit. I'm just saying you couldn't wear it to my party. Well, I feel like you're going to be in Jordans. I'm anyway. not going to be in Jordans. Nah, no Jordans. Shiny no shoe. Jordans. Shiny hey, shoes. Yeah, 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 no, you know what? You know what I thought about? Jordan well. suit. You know what I thought about? You know what I thought? Yeah, breakaway pants and yeah. that. You know what? You know what? <laughs> no, I'm not wearing no breakaway pants. You know what I thought about? Yo, you know what's mad? I know this is going to segue into a topic, yeah? Even though, you know, my week was all right, but whatever. Now... You see, like, certain men that are hench, yeah? Man that are hench should not be wearing no suit, yeah, with no socks. Okay. <laughs> you see, like, man that are hench, yeah? Like, you see when you wear, like, a suit and you can wear the loafers, no socks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man that are hench can't do that. It's, it's true. Right? I, nah, think I, can. Don't like I think they can, but you know like the problem it. is, I think the... the... A, the suit needs to be tailored. Bro, do you realise how, how big your ankles are after squatting that much? <laughs> no, no, I'm saying, I'm like, saying like, the, the suit needs to be tailored. Yeah, Because yeah. it's all about Bro, the taper of the leg. Bro, them loafers getting bust out at the side. It's all about the taper of the leg. <clears throat> the 
hopefully, uh, is it Father Sons? The, the name of the brand? Father Sons. Father Sons that can do some some um <laughs> some some um loafers no, man. for the no, henchman. No, 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 no. Extra, nah. extra latex. If on you're the a hench, yeah. If you're wham, don't be rolling anywhere with no with no socks. It don't look good. Or you're gonna get like tender out the door. Yeah. Straight on. I'm like, fam. You know what? I'll bring <laughs> socks. I'll bring extra socks. You know when you go like um and to a trampoline place. Like, yeah, 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 trampoline yeah, yeah, yeah. in place, and they yeah, got yeah, socks, socks there. The, the socks like, are sick as well, don't you know? With the with the grip on the bottom. Yeah, put some socks on. Them, them socks, are, yeah, say no more. Socks <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the grip give you like ninety nine speed in the juice. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> grip keeps them on. Yeah, runs around the house. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Laminate corners. <laughs> Do all my cleaning quickly. <laughs> nah, but, yeah, if man. You, if you know, you know. If you know, you know. Anyhow, but um. Now all of that, and even to go on to that, the um, did you see the GRM gala? Hold on, man. Jeez, how was your week? How, oh, you, I went first. Oh, you, oh, you went first. Not, like, it, that's what I'm saying. Like, you weren't even paying attention. Teammate used to. Teammate used to. I went first. Mad, you know, Hello, mad. Mad. Sorry, fam. Sorry, fam. Sorry. I'm mad. I'm upsetting the flow. Carry on. GRM gala. Yeah. Did you see? No. Nothing at all. I didn't see anything no. about it. No. 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 I, I seen it. I seen it. I seen it. That's not a load. I don't care though. Not one single I thing. Saw I seen Diggity said he couldn't, couldn't get in or didn't get invited. Just like yeah, that. man. I saw oh, loads. Wow. Like, it made me think, yeah. Obviously, everyone's looking nice. Yeah. Looking clean. Everyone looking sharp. And I thought to myself, okay, cool. Is that the vibe you want for your party? Mm-hmm. Kind of, but not as stocious. Yeah. I ain't as rich as all them niggas. Like, mm-hmm. it's like, that's like level 10. I'm not I only want level 8.5. Wait, so get a suit, really? You don't have to get a suit. Just shirt it's just, and tie. It's shirt. black and white, yeah. Black shirt. and white. Shirt, come looking nice. Black and white. Yes. Okay. It's your party, isn't it? It's my party. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, mate. If you got two options, you can either come in what? You come in black. Well, like black trousers, white shirt. If you want to. I'm not like a butler, innit? Come in all white. Wait, so if you really want like full yardy mode, Jeffrey, all white. Yo, don't know what. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I might try that still. But, but um, Jason Derulo. <laughs> <laughs> but um, basically... So all the people at the GRM gala, and I was like, "What would what would you wear if you went?" Because then people are looking dressed to the nines. If I went to the GRM gala, I'd just wear black trousers and white top, white like shirt, and that keeps it simple, isn't it? Like... <laughs> <laughs> you won't even try and like spice it up or nothing. Spice or how? I'm the spice. Wow. Anyway, so you get invited. <laughs> so get invited. We don't, to no, we don't want to do too much, though. This is the thing. No, this is the thing. Man, you gotta you, make an you've effort. got to make no, an no, effort. No, no, you make an effort, but you don't want to have like a loud freaking outfit and like, I'm you know, saying, mad colourful floral. You don't have to. The technic- I'm not saying go full African prince. Like, Joseph for the technical the freaking raincoat like, jacket and that. I'm not doing that, but I'm just saying. saying I'll keep it simple and just make the fresh trim do all the talking and, you know, the fresh beard trim. and that. Yeah. The beard and. Like, you don't want to do too much. I'd do more than that. What would you do? What to would you be wear? fair, you see, I don't know, you didn't see it, so I can what Google. Rimsey wore, I think. Rimsey? Yeah. yeah. That was kind of clean still. Okay. Not too you much. That, you get me? And I'm sure he had socks on. Yeah, he probably did. Rimsey strikes me as a. You see what I'm saying? Rimsey looks like a real one who actually wears socks. Wear socks you know what I mean? And to be fair, what he wore, nice, smart. I was like, okay. okay. I yeah, can... that's what I'm talking about. Just that is not what you said. I said, okay. <laughs> cool. That is not what you said. You just said a top and black trousers. Yeah, just simple, innit? I ain't gonna lie, really and truly, I probably just ask the person that works at Next what, <laughs> what I should wear. Like. Just to start, yeah. Like, yeah, I got GRM gala. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I got this gala, yeah. The nicest looking suit you've like, got in yeah. what, what should I? What should I wear? Yeah. What's on offer as well? No, I forget. <laughs> what's on offer? Yeah. SL, SL pieces. <laughs> That my car just broke down, yeah. yeah so nah, really you gotta nice me up still. You gotta nice me up for the price. All right. So um, you go just looking. Yeah. Now nah, I'd, 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 I'd ask someone to just sort my outfit out. You're wearing shoes. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'd wear trainers still. I don't really, I don't actually want a pair of shoes. Mm. Yeah. I'd, yeah, I actually don't. I'd wear okay. trainers. I wear trainers everywhere. I'd come there looking fresh, obviously. Um, to be fair, I think because the people there, I'd make that effort. And to be fair, it wasn't just like, this is one thing I have to rate it because it wasn't just the usuals. 
that you'd see. I saw even a few like fitness influencers, some of the ladies, some of the men. I was like, you know what? Okay, okay. You know, branching out. It's quite inclusive still. It's quite like, inclusive. It, it's quite inclusive. You know what I mean? Like, the types of people that you'd be seeing at GRM Gala. I, I kind of I kind of rate it because I didn't really understand what it was for. Mm. I guess it was just like a kind of a take on the Met Gala, but I like how it's a bit more inclusive in it and how the types of people that it includes from, I guess, the culture. What's, what's Juice going to say now? Who's that? Who's that? Tall girl? Um, Who's this? Some very tall woman. Or is he very short? No, Chucky's very, 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 very short. Yeah, Chucky's oh, Chucky? short. Still. Chucky's really short. Oh, it's loaded now. Really That's short. So she's not even tall like that. Them two shouldn't be standing... Bro. <laughs> hey, look at that. Chucky's very, very short. Is that Chucky? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't know is who that is. Is it the blonde thing with the curly hair? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The singer was, was the girl from Love Island. What's her name? She's Bertrand. Oh, Antigone. Antigone. Yeah, that's it. Is that yeah. her? No, no the, yeah. bo- the both look good. Antigone. The both look good, but she just looks really tall. Well, I don't yeah, think Chucky's really one. short. Oh, is he short? Actually, you big up yourself, though. Yeah, big up yourself. You mean like girl, like, or? Nah, don't throw no shade. No, because he just said big up yourself, innit? Like, I thought he was being funny. I'm trying to... Anyway, Chucky's big up yourself. Chucky's big up yourself. Yeah, man, big up yourself. Yeah, now they both look good. I watch his podcast. He's cool. A Carla was it that this year? A Carla. Found that six Oh sure. And then forgot how Instagram works, you know. <laughs> nah, I'm Google Images. Isn't it? Oh, Google Images. Like isn't it? he's struggling. Why don't you go on the Instagram? Okay, go on. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Um, aside from that, I think it was good. One thing to have. Fabulous. Fabulous was there. Mm. Actually, Bobby Schmurder there as well. Bobby Schmurder. Jaron Gala, bro. To English people, yeah, I mean, okay, and this yeah. is it. Bobby Schmurder was there as well. Bobby was there, yeah. the Americans, no, man, are, here, man. But Americans are slowly about. infiltrating England, by the way. That's mm. it, like they're just slowly just taking over things, slowly, like letting them. I'm not gonna get into the football chat, you know. but they're all over football too. It's quite oh, scary, that's not, that's mm. not. like I'm not gonna get into it, but it's quite scary how they're just slowly appearing everywhere. Yeah, not a fan. Post. Juicy's confused. I know, Juicy, eh? why do you, you look like so perturbed? It's just my focus face. Oh, it's, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Cool, 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 cool. Now, while I'm looking at these people, yeah, um, I like something simple like that. Look what Post is wearing. Yeah, Post is wearing. But that's a loud colour. I'll probably do that in blue. Okay. If I was going to go, I'd probably wear something blue still. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to wear something black then. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> yeah. um, it looked good and you have to write it, Who's this Kenza? Who? Kenza. Six Kenza. You're just stuck in this now. See, this is what happens it, when bro. he doesn't look and he looks now. Does she look nice? He's trying to look on the podcast about something he should look I just asked who, who's Kenza. They don't know who Kenza no. is. No, what is it no, saying in her bio? Model. Okay, there you <laughs> so go. So that pretty much tells you, doesn't it, Juice? There you go. She's there a model. Go. She's a model. I, that, yes, well, yeah, but if I say who's Kenza, I thought you'd be like, oh, she's a model from Bum Bum okay, Bum. She was on Bum Bum Bum. Who's Kenza? The model. From where? She was at the GRM gala. She looked nice. Well, was she modeling at the? You know, let's just let's just move on. I follow that now. It's cool. You know? Okay, cool, cool, cool. No, yeah, no, you can give us the update. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Next, next week, week, next week, yeah, cool, next week, cool, next week. Cool, cool. I'll, I'll love that. Give you the rundown. I'll give you a last name. Yeah, but yeah. yeah love that. Um, in terms of that, it looked good. Looked very nice. And to be fair, you have to write it. You have to write the progression when you look back at what Grime Daily used to be. Yeah, man. Yeah, you know I mean, so I write post it for it for what he's done, and it's kind of like. Giving England its own platform, even if not everyone was invited. You so trying to get invited? Me? Yeah, yeah. Only a matter of time. You reckon yeah. they have to pay in, or is it fully an invite only thing? <laughs> <laughs> I think. Um, I think it's invite still. Yeah. Weren't there another gala earlier this year already as well? Was it yeah. What gala? What gala? Weren't there another gala? I feel there, like was there was another, another gala one. recently. There was another there one earlier yeah. this year, but there I can't remember any. which one it was. Well, the Yo, what? That's what I'm saying. Gala. That's what you gotta call your birthday. I'm not calling it that. Call it a gala. I'm not calling it the gala. Yeah, we can't do that. Why not? I say we. It's got nothing to do with me. But... <laughs> 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 it's got absolutely nothing to do with me. No, no, no. Yeah, no, 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 no. Can't do that. Should you do Heart View Gala? Should you do Heart View Gala? No. no. You're like, hey. <laughs> Let's just focus yes. on, on, on the Heart podcast for now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Let's just focus on the podcast for now. All right, I don't know. Let's, let's get this thing. I mean, it is, it is actually this... like a, an avenue of marketing. You get yeah, yeah, yeah. Because people will go to the... years time. Go for the gala. Fam, People go fam. for the gala. Invite only. We post it up. That's content. I'm with you. Yeah. That's content. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yo, you know what? Watch. Watch. It's not, nah, it's not even a gala. Watch. It's a brunch. A brunch. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay, brunch. 
You don't do brunch? Like Rock Nation. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Hard food brunch. Hard food brunch. Yeah, hard food brunch. We'll go there. It's got a bench and <laughs> some Sandwiches. patties and, um, you know, <laughs> dumpling. Nah, so no, no, I know, real. that's a sick idea. <laughs> That's a sick idea. Yeah, cool, yeah, People eating we'll food bench. off the bench. <laughs> Literally. We'll get a bench. Yeah, nah, we've got a bench. And it's like one of those challenge... No, someone's going to kill themselves. <laughs> 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 someone's going to kill themselves trying to, trying to do the bench. Though. What yeah. if we get one of those punch machines or something? Okay. I hate those, man. Same, to be fair. It's kind of I've never like, done one, though. I've done one, but I've like, never I hate, one. Like, I hate I them mean, in those bro. social settings. You know, like mm. sometimes... Like there was one in a club. Why is there one in a club? Obviously, man, ego, gonna... man. Yeah, take your ego, man. Ego. Take your anger out, innit? Bad no, ego. Not gonna lie. Yeah, uh, look at uh, punch, still. I've you done one? I've done one, like, with um, Redrins in a place that will forever be, um, what's the word? Unnamed. Okay. Okay. Yeah, the place is unnamed. But, um, <laughs> yeah, me and my Redrins, yeah, like, we do it. So I, I, yeah, I don't know. 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 <laughs> I think you get tickets. Bro. Yeah. <laughs> so um oh, man. <laughs> went to, um I was I was punching a thing and I like boxing it so like, I, I tried that okay so you're gonna box and you do it like a proper Same straight style. punch. You're gonna do a good straight punch, pure talk, like give it shoulder bit of shoulder, <laughs> give it a twist and whatever. But, yeah. <laughs> but That's my other brethren my other brethren's doing he's just like swinging his arm and he's licking it harder, I was thinking. You know, punching properly. If you punch like yeah, that, it's just I'd it's see all it. ego. It's all numbers. It's ego, no, all, man. All is, yeah. You just got to get a good whip on you on your shot. Yeah, yeah, I get yeah. the whip. Literally, whip get whip and snap. Whipping. Literally. Okay. I don't do it just because I have a feeling if I do it, I'm gonna pull something in my shoulder. Mm. Okay. And I just don't want to do it. You just hold yourself back in life like that, though. Say again. You just hold yourself back in life like that. I actually do. Mm. Do you know most things like you just even get you see like if I play a ball game. I don't want to play because when I throw a ball, I feel I'm going to like injure my rear delt. Nick thinks he's Goku. <laughs> you know, like, like... <laughs> no, and I'm being serious because like there's been times I've done I things... thought you were going to say, oh, I feel like I'm going to like ruin the space time continuum or something. Speed <laughs> 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 of light. That's the ball that fast and hard and like, I'm just nah, mashing up. It's only there's injured. a hole in the atmosphere. I don't want to get injured. That's why I don't, don't do many stuff. This is I mean. my final form. <laughs> so I don't do it. That's why I'm just like, you know, I kind of, I'm kind of like Spider Man. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. I kind of like hold back all the time. Yeah, yeah. With all that power comes mm-hmm. bear responsibility, it? That's what I mean. I mean, it's, 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 it's gifted yeah. to us. Mm. You know who's also powerful? Who? Lizzo. <laughs> too much power. Why is too much power? I'm going to call her R. Belly on Twitter. R. Belly. R. Belly. I mean, okay. So I, I was gonna say to so our belly, you know. So Lizzo, our belly, she's coming under fire because members of her team are saying that she's been um, toxic, toxic, basically yeah, forcing them to touch the the nude performers in Amsterdam and eat bananas from vaginas. And this is the I thought when I heard that party, I was like the banana vagina bit. I was like, but why? <laughs> no, because like, I was like. Why would you do that? There's a whole there's a whole bar in Amsterdam where you gotta where they put bananas in their vaginas. Well you been there? Nah, nah, nah. Okay. I've been. In a while, I, to be I think it's a new establishment. Oh, definitely would have been there. Okay. I was used to um, bananas in pajamas, not flipping bananas in vaginas. No, no pajamas involved. <laughs> bananas, no <laughs> pajamas. Madness. No pajamas. Wild. Some flashlights tumbling down. Oh yeah. Oh. Flashlights shaking banana. Just tumbling down the stairs. <laughs> And she's also fat shaming as well. I think all the songs that could have come with bananas well, and vaginas. A little fat shaming is crazy, by that the way. That is mad. It's crazy, by the way. Because when you, like, you can't fat as a hench guy, you want to be the only hench guy in the world, isn't it? She no. wants to be the only fat in the village. Yeah, she wants. Okay. No, but the thing Wait, is, that's yeah, wild. I heard The only you. fat person in the village. <laughs> like, fat's not an identity, like, it's a descriptive word. <laughs> I Jesus heard that Christ. she was like shaming them <laughs> for putting on weight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're getting too big, but they're a dancer, isn't it? But they're doing cardio. Yeah, but she's get, they're getting too big. 
No, but they're inclusive in it, so they're, like, they're not like the average tour dancer. No, I know, I know, but you still need to perform the moves no, of course, yeah. to a certain standard. So she's saying they're not performing the moves to a certain standard. Yeah, so basically she's hired big dancers yeah. and they're getting too big. You know what I mean? If you need big, if you got big dancers... What do you think is going to happen? <laughs> no, because obviously it's like... They're not meant to get bigger. Do you think when they're touring the world on a hectic schedule... You get me. They're not going to be eating fuckery, fam. <laughs> exactly. No, but you can say that to anyone. Gonna be, yeah, but do you think the fat people are going to be meal prepping? But you could say that to anyone. That's like saying, oh, Grealish, like, it's okay for you to drink alcohol. <laughs> nah, that is well. <laughs> that's different. Is. That's different. I think that's different. That is cold, you know. I meal prepping, you know. I just, just registered it. <laughs> But it's not really different. Yeah. No, if you're a dancer and you're supposed to be keeping in shape, but the so thing is, they have know, a certain man, look. Man. If they get fam. slimmer, they won't be fat. They're not going to be dancing. Yeah, but they're not supposed to get fatter either. They're not supposed to get so bigger. How are they supposed to maintain? Maintain your weight. Yeah, but it's body positivity, fam. They should be able to dance. Exactly. At whatever, at whatever weight. Nah, they got to maintain. Oh, so, so what's oh, happening is half so the routine is stopping out of breath. Maybe yeah. That's probably what happens for it to flag off. If we did flag up on Lizzo's radar, like, it's like, yo, I, I hired you at 19 stones. You got to stay 19 stone for him. You get I, me? I mean, if it's contracted, if you want to contract it, like, say, She's still listen. singing me like this. Yeah, there's a pound range. You get me? <laughs> Certain it's, LBs. It's like a whole two minutes of the song. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm with, I'm with that, though, to be fair. I do get that. I mean, don't fat shame, but obviously stick to your weight requirements, isn't it? Yeah, so what's the difference? It's not it's difficult, though. Yeah, it's what's difficult. the difference between that and then like runway models being told, yeah, you got to stay exactly the same thing. If you're hired for a certain aesthetic, your employer's allowed to but, tell yeah, you, yeah, yo, the you know whole thing is. is you should be should be accepted at any size. That's so. the thing. Yeah. That's, that's, that's what her, that's she's pushing. That's it. That's she's her pushing agenda. that agenda yeah, but out do you, there. Do you really think she's little about that life? No, but I'm saying if that's your agenda, you pre- you're an international like pop star. You're pushing you're pushing this ideal onto people. Yeah, you then can't backtrack on that and then say. Hey, hey, you're too fat now. No, 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 no. After fun. this show, straight onto the bus, there's a salad waiting for you. Or go on the treadmill. Think, yeah, don't even think about going to McDonald's. <laughs> I'm going. I'm going. But you can't go. You, uh, there's a salad <laughs> on the bus. No, but obviously, Lizzo knows how to maintain anyway. weight. We can see. Does she? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She hasn't got bigger, she. She ain't got bigger. She's been out for a while now. She maintained the weight. I, I don't care. That's though. what I'm saying. She's probably like, yo, if I can do it, you guys can too. You get really. Like, I feel like she's one of those. I think people. it's. It's one of them ones because obviously she's a big woman and people just associate being big with being jolly in it, like Santa Claus and that. She what? Where, where, does like that. Big, what? where does this big and jolly thing come from? You heard it, don't you? That's the thing, innit? John Candy. Why? Being big and jolly. People think she's big and jolly, but she's big. Big and jolly. Big and mean. Kingpin's big and mean. He's mean. Kingpin. No, but it's kind of jolly though, isn't it? Kingpin. No. Kingpin was... No, it's not. He's you not just smash your head in? He's not jolly at all. I feel like he was laughing when Spider-Man was on the ground. <laughs> or is it Batman? Which one? Man, that's, that's an evil laugh to kill someone. That's jolly. Like, no. some people don't laugh. Wouldn't you consider Joker to be jolly? No, he's crazy. crazy. Yeah, he's but that's he's jolly as well. He's happy. No, he's, he's not, he's not fat as well. No, I'm just saying, I'm just talking about jolly. No, no, no. He's not jolly. He's crazy. He's crazy. He's not right in no, He's actually clinically insane. He's insane. <laughs> <laughs> like, really, really. But I think like, all, all of these villains laugh. Yeah, because they're unhinged. A lot of, yeah, this, they're unhinged. They're not right in the head. Yeah, but who are we to say like your happiness isn't as good as anyone else's happiness? Because most likely, all the things they want to do, people die. And that makes them happy? So are you, are you so that means they're not right in the head? Yeah? Are you no, yeah. The villains? I no, I'm think. just saying that like, I don't even know what I'm saying. I'm no, just, I'm just being sidebar. Like, okay. So, but um, at the moment, this new um, event that's happening with DC, your camera's overheating, by the way. Um, with DC, they do this thing called um, Insomnia Night Terror. So, this new super villain called Insomnia putting everyone in the world to sleep, yeah? Mm. yeah. Um, and they, they follow the different um, dreams that everyone has. And the nightmare that the Joker has is that he's actually killed the Batman. Yeah. He's killed him. Yeah. And because he's killed him... Got nothing to do? No, he, yeah, he just turned into a regular man. He's, he goes to work yeah. and um, his subconscious is that because he's killed the real Batman, he doesn't know when he's sleeping that he turns into the Batman and beats up and <laughs> kills villains as well. Mm. Sixth story. Very yeah. sixth story. Right? Yeah. Makes sense. Do you know Batman never kills him? I, I don't really follow it like that. Just telling you. Yeah. Batman, guys out there. Batman, Batman doesn't him. kill anyone. Can't kill I'm going to say, yeah, Batman <laughs> doesn't kill but Batman can't kill him. Because he's had bad chances. If he, just, if he just kills him, he's got no reason for, to be Batman. No, no, you still have reasons because uh, still, yeah, everyone's still, still but being the main bad, reason but... is Joker. Yeah. But anyway, Lizzo, fat shaming. How dare I she? think Lizzo would be a great DC villain. I think she would be. She, that's not a Marvel villain. 
I think she'd be good. What would you call her name? Apart from no, I'm not gonna say that. Lizzo be eating. That's a that's an Instagram handle. You see, when I read bee eating, I thought no, it was beating. Lizzo beating. I thought it was beating. Lizzo be eating. Wait, is the name Lizzo oh. beating? That's no, just... Lizzo be eating. But Lizzo be eating. <laughs> Lizzo be eating. So it just looks like Lizzo be eating in it. Lizzo be eating. Yeah. That's a sick villain name. Is it? Is it? It's Lizzo be eating. Yeah, it's not. It's not. It's not. Oh, really. nah. What's What's her mission to? She was a villain. Like, what's her? What's her villain mission? Like, what's, what's <laughs> to, to, right, to, stop. Nah, to, to, <laughs> ah, to, to kill the world with vagina bananas. <laughs> Toxic <laughs> vagina bananas. Eat it! <laughs> Why? Eat it! Why? Oh. I don't know. I'm just, that's just silly. I, I don't well. know. <laughs> yeah. I never really liked her. I, I'm not really fond of her just because you see, like, I know people will be kind of the agenda that she pushes is popular. However, for me, I'm just not really with it. Also, it's a case of like as long as why everyone's so surprised. I just never I've got bad vibes from her all the time. Mm. I think always, yeah, I it, it seems a bit needed. Yeah. I've always got super villain vibes from her. No joke now. Like, yeah. Literally, like I've got bad guy vibes from her. I think it's because you you think she looks like the penguin. Mm. In the right coat. Yeah, in the coat. Yeah, 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 she does. She does. Yeah. But yeah. yeah. You should just oh, go back and play on the flute, man. That's, that's, how how she, Burgundy. that's how she um, hypnotizes people. Must be in the Pie Piper vibes. The creep vagina bar. Banana vaginas. The banana Pie Piper. Wow. I don't think that. I don't think DC will put that out. Mm. For some reason, not really sure why. HTC would do. <laughs> no, that's right now, image comics line. That is. Did you check out Utopia? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, yes. I can't stop texting about it. The first, uh, first time. <laughs> okay. Yeah. What do you man think? Well, like, you lot were the what ones you I was said, texting. Yeah, what you said. Mm, 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 I mm. thought the exact same thing. I was like, yeah, I agree. You know when someone has a conversation, you're, gonna you're like... Up. You're going to build up a problem, man. It's okay, just, okay. This is, is, this is you. You, nah, go, you, know, you go. You go off. You go off. It's this not is even, your it's go. Not even that. It's this not is your go. It's not even that. No, but just don't, don't down talk it from the get-go. No, no, you go. I ain't, I ain't even hoping like that for it. Go off. It's just amazing. No, go on. It's amazing. Go off. I'm going off right now. That's not really amazing. It's not Astro World. Okay. But it's when Astro World came off, you were like run around the room. Because Astro yeah, World was, was literally perfect. Why? Because production was just incredible. Mm. It was intricate. Yeah. And Travis Scott obviously is not a lyrical guy, mm. but lyrically he performed all right, I think, on Astro World. Features or did what it was a very solid project. Okay. So what's the difference to Utopia? Utopia. The production's more out there. I yes. think the production's more shock. Experimental, in it. experimental, when yeah. It, it, but when you when the experimental side wears off, it's gonna lose replay value. Yeah, I think every big artist has an experimental album, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm, I'm not, I'm not knocking Travis against. I'm not, knock, I'm not knocking Travis for this at all. I'm just saying, like, this album ain't Astro World, and I think a lot of people were expecting another Astro World. I, I haven't listened to Astro World from start to finish either. By the way, really? like, I'm not, I'm not Travis Scott. Like, I don't. That's not really my vibe. All of that kind of music. Oh, okay. it's not really my vibe like yeah. that. But I was on the way to a festival, and on the drive there, that driver was like, oh, "I'm going to play this album." So I listened yeah. to it. I was like, "This is kind of cool." I liked. I definitely liked the production. Like, I liked. This is Astro World or Utopia. Utopia. Oh, okay. I yeah, liked yeah, the yeah. Production. Like, production. I, I incredible. All the writing credits and who yeah. was involved on what. I was kind of. I could kind of hear it as well. I think the Beyonce feature is a big thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially given where she's at and what she's making, how they managed to make that work. I thought that was pretty sick. Um, it sounds like it's off Renaissance. Yeah, yeah. Like yeah, it sounds yeah, like yeah. it was something yeah. that maybe came from there, and she was like, "You can kind of have that if you want." Yeah. Wouldn't be surprised if like some. Because he's hardly on it himself. On that tune, pretty yeah, not yeah. really. Yeah. Um, but literally, like again, with, uh, it's, it feels wrong to compare it with Astro World, but obviously, Astro World is like pinnacle of his career almost you get me so it's like and obviously because he missed out on the awards everyone's looking to this one to like yo this one's gonna do it for him yeah but like i feel like it's a hard left well it is a hard left it's experimental but production wise as amazing as it is 
it's not as intricate. Mm-hmm. It's very spacey. It's very melody, drums. Yeah, yeah it's boom. very sparse. In it melody, yeah, yeah, melody, drums, Travis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get so that, Travis I get is it. very clear on this album. You can hear that card everything he's saying. Trash. Fiend, the whole song. Just the Carty feature. What is what I'm saying? Lyrically, really you had to listen to everyone. Like, you listened to what everyone was saying. Yeah, he wasn't saying so a lot. Usually it's like, oh, Travis albums are more of a vibe and that kind of stuff. Yeah. Once, one or two listens in, it's no longer a vibe. It's, mm. we're listening to what Travis what? is saying now. Um, I think, yeah. the first time I listened to it, <clears throat> I was like, okay. Sounds quite um, abstract. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was thinking, well, it's a bit different from um, Astral World. But <clears throat> in a way, is that wrong? No, not necessarily. However, I thought, as soon as I heard it, I thought, like, this is something that Kanye would make in... And then when people speak, like, when Tim come in the group chat talk about, yo, this is Jesus. Yeah, so Jesus is a little brother. And I was like, yeah, yeah, I, I can hear it one. 100%. And it was, don't get me wrong, it's not my bag, but I can get where it's coming from. You yeah, I can appreciate, appreciate it. it. You see like, what I'm saying? It's like, because I'm not going to sit there and play it all the time or play it like that, but I can understand what you're trying to do and I can understand the kind of direction you're moving in, so it makes sense. See what I mean? In terms of replay value, you probably won't have a lot, but that's because... For me, when you're trying to do kind of like experimentation and abstract kind of things that are trying new different things, trying a little bit of this, trying a little bit of that, it kind of sometimes locks you in. If if you don't fully vibe with that, it kind of locks you out of it after the yeah, first yeah, listen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, me? yeah. A lot so, of people were popping up well, on the timeline and group chats as well, like, oh, yo, this is shit, this is crap, like, this is rubbish. It's and it's like, I can understand why you'd think that. If you're not ready for that vibe, if you're not in the yeah, middle yeah, of that. Yeah, Same yeah. with Jesus. Like a lot of people were like, yo, after the first this? listen, yo, what the hell is this? Yo, Kanye's lost it, right? And it's like, nah, if you're willing to accept that from them, if yeah. you're, you know, Kanye had the freaking the no cover and yeah, yeah, the, yeah. the way he was rolling it out. It's like, okay, this is going to be different. I feel like from Utopia, people weren't really expecting this. Yeah. I think because there was no real single, or well, there was K-pop, but Yeah. People were expecting something different. But, People were expecting this. You know what it is this. as well? <clears throat> I think that because you see, like, because Kanye has done that with Jesus, mm. it's it's allowed to create a space for that kind of music and that release. And sometimes I feel like if such a big star like Kanye never did that, this wouldn't be received by us the way we've received it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Do you know what I mean? Well, but, I think- I think that's the reason why Kanye started to even like make him more of a Kanye thing, but that's the reason why he is the goat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. because like he's, you know, that video. That's why he's the goat. Yeah. Well, there's a yeah. big Kanye-sized hole. Pause. There's a big Kanye-sized hole on the album. <laughs> wow. Void, void. There's a Kanye hole, fam. Yeah. Void. Yeah. There's a, there's... This man says a Kanye. It's like for that album to sound like that. And Travis and Kanye to be linked. You need Kanye to be there to kind of really pull it to the full. Not even so that you need it, but it's just like for him not to be there, yeah. it's like, yo, like that's, that's, the, would he not that's deliberately done. Like, executive yeah. producer, sorry. Like, even yeah, like, yeah. Kanye I don't even know. Him. I haven't looked at the question. Is he not? No, nah, he's not. I, I don't think he was an executive producer on the album. Yeah, but then he brought him out in Rome, which I wasn't yeah, expecting. Did. So I'm yeah. thinking, okay, and I why is... He had a verse on there that got taken off somewhere. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So, yeah. But, but like, what, relationship's weird anyway, and it like it's one of them where like I don't know, I just don't you get never know why. when they're brethren and when they're not, and then I that's why everyone the, was shocked when he brought him out and yeah. that. Cause I think like, that's or even like a, a scream, like a Kanye. Like a, Kanye ah! I thought he was gonna get something. <laughs> like it's Kanye, you know what I mean? You think he'd get an ad lib, something, some something utopia? Oh, I don't know, but I do like it. There's definitely songs I skip. But even okay, but this is the thing. Even the the songs that. <laughs> what? No, I'm laughing. Go on. <laughs> Yo, I bought this year. <laughs> talk to yeah, the listeners. Talk to the listeners. It says cheese yeah, you lemon cheesecake inspired, and the inspired part didn't click. 
thought it was cheesecake. It's oh. not cheesecake. It's, it's yogurt. Oh yeah, yeah. It's a oh, yogurt okay. pot. Oh wait, no, this, oh, no, wait. wait a Where's minute. The, where wait is a the minute. biscuit? Where, <laughs> the they what? lied. They lied. What? He's getting ready to make a complaint live That's on the pod. He was getting ready. To, he's getting ready to cut out the yogurt people. Carry on. I forgot what I was saying. Oh yeah. So even the standout songs aren't really stand out because they're not, you know, there's not really catchy hooks on there. There's not memorable verses. I don't know. I'm tri- We have to check back in like a month or two with this album because I, I can't see where the shelf life comes from from it. I don't think it has a lot of replay value. I don't, I don't think yeah. it has one. Yeah. I don't think it, I, I felt the same about Kendrick's last album. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, I feel yeah. like it was like, it was like, I feel like I understood exactly what he was yeah, doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it was great. I, yeah, it was yeah. very good, but Replay value wise, I don't think there's many people playing songs off that album. Mm, yeah. Like at this present moment, yeah. I feel like it's going to be the same for Utopia. And then it's someone that's not like in that culture and listens to that type of music frequently. It does even seem already like people are kind of Utopia. Yeah, it kind of yeah. seems like people are a little bit over it already. That's intent, it? There's no sickle mode. There's no yeah, butterfly thing. There's, there's no standout. Yeah, there's no tune that's going other than that fiend tune. You can even sing along to really. Just that theme tune, really, that I could see going off in like a party. The theme, or, or the, the, fe- the intro. Yeah, 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 yeah. Or at like a festival, that's about it. Mm, but other yeah. than that, I don't really see too much coming from it. Um, what was I going to say, though? I don't feel like, sorry, I don't feel like people, like I, I, as someone that doesn't listen to that music, I could see the impact that Astro World had on music and where it was going at that yeah, time. Yeah, I yeah, don't, yeah. it's definitely not that. Yeah. But to see the thing with the whole experimental thing. Obviously, when Jesus came out, I don't want to say it was the first of its kind because it wasn't. But you know, for a hip hop artist, a rap artist, whatever, to 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 do it, is... yeah, to do an experimental album, it was mad. It was wild. It was probably the first. Since then, we've had you know, Tyler As the Creator of our generation. Well, to sound like that experimental, to sound like that, sound like that yeah. of our generation, and of that magnitude, just because obviously other rappers would have tried it. However, it's a case that because they're not as big as Kanye, it's like with some people, an album like Yeezus could like like finish them. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It could turn people off completely. However, because Kanye's Kanye and you can see the creative directions that he does try to go in and it's the size of his kind of like um, prestige, he's like everything that he does in in a way, because it's him, we'll receive it and we'll look at it and say, you know what, I'm not going to write it off straight away. I'll listen, give it time. And I think that because Travis has done this and tried his way to put out something like this, I think, I don't know, it's for me in terms of, like the grip on the culture that Astro World had, it's not gonna get anywhere near that. No, not mm-hmm. at all. You know, I, I think um, what's interesting is to pick, kind of piggyback off your your point what you just said. You um, to piggyback <laughs> off your point, anyways. <laughs> um, yeah, give me a piggyback, bro. Or not. Yeah. yeah. What did you say? Anyway. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Anyways, um, because the the sound that Trav, Travis did on this album is so akin to a Yeezus and it's easy to kind of say, oh, that sounds like Yeezus, the shock factor isn't there as much as when you hear a, a Tyler do a Igor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then when yeah, you, yeah. you're like, yo, I didn't know my mama could do that, you know, that's yeah. when you you get that Kanye moment again, like of Yeezus to yeah. begin with. You're like, I didn't know my man could do that. You get Andre through, you get three stacks with yeah, them yeah, look yeah. below. I didn't know a man could do that. Yeah, you know and I mean? that's so, kind of, that was kind of my point. Like, literally, when Yeezus came out, there was nothing even to really compare it with. Yeah. Whereas, yeah, you got Utopia straight away, Yeezus. Mm. I keep going to Ego, but I'm pretty sure there's been other experimental albums. Was it uh, Eight and Heartbreaks came before that, right? Yeah, I'd yeah, probably yeah. say that was probably even the precursor to Yeezus. I feel like that in itself was quite a big moment. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. Well, sonically, they're totally different, isn't it? Yeah. No, yeah. sonically, totally different, but in terms of uh, experimentation and taking. Oh, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, in terms yeah, of yeah. It, I feel Obviously, that one came first, and I feel like you probably you could probably make a case that Eight and Heartbreaks is probably more important than Yeezus in terms yeah, of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, like, yeah, like, yeah. Because yeah. that, that sound. 
But that 808, 808 Heartbreaks, at least on Jesus, yeah, he's he's rapping, he's giving you bars. The yeah, beats yeah, yeah. are slightly different, but he's giving you bars still. There's quotables in there. There's some tunes on there that aren't so abrasive in it. But yeah. 808 and Heartbreaks, that really whole different. thing was like, yo, what the hell? Like, yeah. what yeah. is this? Different. Like, even from, like, beats to vocals to how it was mixed, all of that stuff. Auto-tune. Like, yeah. 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 I think that was that was quite crazy in it. Cause yeah. It was like, T-Pain came out with the whole auto-tune thing, and then Kanye said, I'll swear down. Yeah. <laughs> is that what we're doing? Is that what we're doing? Okay. And he just he just got busy with it, innit? I think stronger case for that to be more important to the culture, in my opinion. Mm. Oh yeah, yeah, no, definitely, definitely. Ace Ace is a lot more important to the culture than Jesus. Um I don't know, I've not even to be a big take. Well, you know that you know but uh Byron Messiah. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Who's that? Taliban's. Taliban's, that's the tune. Oh, yeah. Have you heard? I still don't know the song off the top of my head, you know. The apparently, Song of the Summer. Yeah. It's the song that Jesus says. Dead is to it, like, there's no song yeah, yeah, yeah. Really. It's yeah. this. It's basically one of the songs of the half summer. Yeah. Pretty much. It's all the songs of the week. Have you heard, <laughs> have you heard, have you heard <laughs> it on. Huh? Burner Boy remixed it, so it's obviously big, in it? Well, I was going to okay. say, have you heard the remix? Yes. Have you heard it, the radio edit? Oh, no. Nah. I was, you know nah. what? I was thinking about this the other day. There's some songs in it. Like, there's just no point. There's in no having, point, there's you no know. Point there's no <laughs> point. There's no point. Like, <laughs> it's like, oh, wait, yeah. Cutting I did out, like, 60% of the yeah, song. Yeah, I'm yeah, like, 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 bro, what, what, what's the point? What's the point? I, yeah, I, I, heard it, edit? I heard it once and it made me realize how much bad words are in the song. Yeah, and yeah, I was like, yeah. oh, bro, this is actually a pretty not clean song. No, but, no, <laughs> but also, <laughs> yeah, sometimes, like, the words that they have to cut out on radio, not necessarily bad words, but it's like, now it's more even in the realm of, like, suggestive words. There's certain slang words you can't use on there that don't directly because the song itself yeah it's not called Taliban it's called Tally <laughs> no, oh, they've even had to change that yeah the, ta- the change Taliban it's called Tally yeah because yeah, even that the main word yeah. even the main word of Taliban the song, it doesn't say that in the song on the radio edit because like and that's what I'm saying like, edits. Yeah. that's what I'm saying like, that's mad like the but main word of the tune I ain't yeah. gonna lie I don't think I feel like Burner Boy struggled on it honestly I feel like it could have done without him uh, I think I feel like Burner's just like is an effortless artist. But I think because... And that the, song wasn't effortless. It I've, sounded like he really tried to fit into that pocket. But I think, you know what it is? With the way that he was on that song, because the song was so big before he went on there, he has to step correct. Yeah, but... I don't it's a no think risk it is. situation. In, like, there's like, you can't take no risks. This, yeah. has, this has to has, clap. It in. has to slap. Like, it has to clap because this is potentially a tune of the summer. And I think that I think that's probably even why he jumped on it yeah. from a perspective of no, yeah, it I, was I kind of bubbling it was to bubbling, be some, It was and bubbling. It was bubbling. Like, people are saying, that, is this song of the summer? Yeah. And then you're going to say, okay, we put Burner Boy on there. Yeah. This has to. Remember, he had song that's of the summer nice. last year, innit? Yeah. But I was, I was, I was happy. When I seen Burner Boy's name on the song, I think everyone was. But uh, well, I don't know. Are you happy with his contribution? Because I've, I've really. Well, I only, I've only heard the radio edit, so I like... <laughs> that's oh, half nah, the song nah, gone. Nah, yeah, nah. so I, I, my judgment of it ain't really that. It's all right. I think I'd much prefer it without. I think with him, it's a little different. But the way you got to look at it is that with him on the song, it's the eyes it opens up to. No, yeah, 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 I, no yeah, yeah. I totally, hundred percent. I get it, and I was happy for both of them. You know, I, mean, I was happy for Byron. And it's... The <laughs> if you, have you seen the video? Nah, nah. Have you seen the video? Bro, I don't know what the song is. <laughs> yeah, Tim don't even know what we're talking about. <laughs> hey, have you, have you seen the video? I'm lost. I'm lost. There's one girl with a BBL, yeah. In that video, I'm like... Huh? Is that, is that the one from the gra- um, Graham Gala? No. Bear knows with one... Uh, next him. Oh, oh if you I look at the video. I seen him posted. I seen him yeah. posted. Yeah. If you see the video, yeah, this BBL is looking mad. But anyway, uh, but literally, yeah, I, I'm not happy with Burn Boy in that song. But I think it's all right. Sitting on top of the world, though. Sitting on top of the world. Uh, top, I, I hear of that. World, top of the world. Top of the world. You mean Brandy and Max? No, no. Me Burn Boy. Burn Boy. But they sampled it. But yeah, yeah, they sampled it. But <laughs> yeah, I heard it. The thing is, yeah, yeah, I heard it. I, I heard Brandy Max. Like the tune. <laughs> yeah, I heard it. <laughs> That's Tim's, that's Tim's I like it. Yeah. Everything that you're talking about, you know how you said, oh, it's kind of bubbling, kind of bubbling. Yeah. Yeah. And then they, got, they dropped the 21 Savage verse. I've heard it without it. I heard yeah. it without it. Saying, without it, yeah, I was I like, oh, I like this song, but I'm not doing it. And then when the 21 Savage verse. Yeah. That was it for you. Sick. You like it? Mace. Classic Mace. It, it, I Mace. wouldn't go that far. Yeah. It gives the Mace vibe to it. I wouldn't go that 
Oh. Have you heard it? You ain't even heard it? Yes, I've heard it. Oh, you have heard it? You just haven't heard, heard it? it? No, I, I said I don't listen to it. That means oh, I've heard okay. It, but I don't play no, okay. regularly. Yeah, I, I, play, I, I that play the version, version without him. Yeah, I did that too. Yeah, I did the I rest. play the version without him because what did he say? What did 21 Savage say after he released it? Because oh, I heard he's he not feeling it. He said, I heard because of the reception, I saw something that says I'm not doing another um, song with an Af- African artist. Ah? Oh, that's true. What? Or that, or the That's Nigerian. what I heard. But the thing is, though, the, like the Nigerian internet cohort. Yeah, I don't know what else to call it because I was going to say Nigerian Twitter, but look, they're everywhere. Um, now, don't laugh, fam, because now that makes it sound mad. <laughs> don't, don't it is mad still. I went quiet. I went quiet. I said a racist. DJ, you know that was. Hello, you know, racist, know, black man. Um, we do black not people. co-sign those thoughts. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So we love and we love Nigerian Twitter. We love Nigerian Twitter. Nigerian you Instagram. You are our brothers and sisters, because West you Africa. Like you like giving the most joke. Yeah, but I'm saying they're they're active, like they're really, yeah. they're like not they're, playing. Yeah, they're not ramping. That's still. what I'm saying. Yeah, but nah, they're, they're quite and, active still. Dude. And I said some, and that's what I'm saying. Like good fight. And yeah, to be England, fair, World Cup. Part of me is like that's the reason why I didn't listen to it. Oh, is yeah, it Nigerian? Because no, because wow, no, what podcast no, is this? No, no, I mean like no, you're not listening to what I'm saying. Oh, sorry, that's why I didn't listen to the version with Twenty One Savage. Oh, okay, because you're ripping. I listened to the version without Twenty One Savage. Yeah, 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 I got it on a playlist in my car, and the fact is that when I saw that, I heard someone says, "Ah, oh, someone." I saw something. He said, oh, "I'm not doing another one of the African artist because the Americans must have not ran to it." And I'm like, "Yeah, but that's like when I saw the." reaction from Americans to Jay Huss's album. Yeah. I'm like, they just don't get it. They're different. You know, so with, with um I also give twenty one some bail because sometimes he says things like it's A taken out of context or sometimes he just says things that comes to I his actually mind. Really like 21 Savage. Yeah, yeah, I do like him. He's actually, he's actually, he's actually I do like him. Geezer. So like but Americans are stupid because they're Nigeria, like... Americans. <laughs> yes, fam. Yo. Yes, fam. I'm... I'm so glad you've got a camera angle now. Like, yes, yo. Fam. This yes, is not fam. us come saying come this. <laughs> it's AI, nigga. <laughs> it's AI. <laughs> no, but Americans are stupid in that respect because they really like don't get anything. So, for example, like uh, who is it? Gigs rocked a tune of PDD recently. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Pretty like everyone's gonna be like, hey, that's all right over here. But like yeah. Americans do not. Understand in like UK rap whatsoever. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. they're not rating right UK Never rap. Well. I like yeah. I like that tune. I like Central, it. Sorry, yeah, that tune's sorry. It's yeah. good, but I'm saying so. Central C, for instance, is clapping off because of TikTok. I don't think they really care about his lyrics. I don't think they really care yeah. about his mm. tune. It's just in fashion. English music in general. I think Pink Panthers is slapping right now. She's clapping off right now, but it's because she's got the tune of Ice Spice. And there's like when there's a not like a notable american figure attached to a uk song they might pay a bit the more might. attention yeah. Yeah. but at the same time they actually like disregard uk music yeah. mad hard well yeah well, can you blame them no because i listen to more uk music than i do america we're music. from uk and we can relate to the, they no, can't, the thing is shall i tell you what it is shall i tell you what it is americans eh? have like this americans don't have americans don't relate to anybody well, except yeah. for themselves except yeah. america at like that's the center of the world mm-hmm. what, but that's how i feel about american music what have i got to I mean, relate to american music about like no you're yeah, fair enough to that's a degree perfectly fine. i do think that the way that americans see the rest of the world is like everywhere else is underdeveloped and i think they're like no we're more, like yeah, the yeah. Not like virtual. underlings and even, they are, yeah, even like with the whole Afro beats wave, it's like the whole world is on it. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's, Apart from them. Yeah. It's like, exactly. it's not even like, yo, they don't need America. Yeah. You know what I mean? Afro beats doesn't it's need America. Not all. It's like, I look at the way that Afro beats has been the last few years in the development. And even now, like, I will play, I'm more likely to play. Wizkid, Davido, or Burner Boy, than, and I play Thames every day. Yeah. And I'd rather play that than, to be honest, any like rapper from America bar Facts. the the Legacy Act. Yeah. Legacy yeah. Act's fair. That's, that's, that's different because it's, it's a Legacy Act. Like, mm. And you got to see now, in terms of Legacy Acts, you have to class Cole, Drake, yeah. even Future. Yeah, as yeah, legacy acts because yeah. they are like I'm talking about all these new ones. I don't listen to none of them. I don't listen to any of the little. Don't listen to none of them. None of them. And it's a case that because I don't know, man. It's just something in the music, man. I can just 
relate to you feel it in your soul with the African and Afro but, beats? Well, Amapiano is huge right now, and I feel like it's not doing anything in America. I feel like America has nothing to do with how big Amapiano mm. is right now. And um, they don't need it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like it goes to show how much uh, America is not needed. Kind of. Uh, all right. The thing is, you know what? Quickly before you change change subject, it's kind of like I feel because the machine of labels has run America for so long. The American sound, not sound, but the American influence has run its course. And 100%. the way that we see music here in England, even though, yes, we have like labels and whatever doing their thing, but the way that grime came through, the, right, the way that all UK music has been pushed, we relate to it because it's not engineered. Well, it seems underdeveloped, not underdeveloped, but we're in a different process in it in terms of, um, not different process, different part of the process, should I say, yeah. in terms of where the UK music scene is compared to the American music scene, like the American. And it's a totally different machine as well. Different, machine, different yeah. size it machine. Is, is. Oh, yeah, that's, yeah, that's yeah. what I'm saying, because it's uh, the w- different yeah. stages of the journey. UK artists having record deals and being able to actually be successful yeah. in music has been a thing of what the past 10 years. Yeah. If yeah. that, like, being able to, like... Actually really make money. To say, oh, okay, as a UK artist, I can actually feed my family off being yeah. a musician. Whereas prior to 10 years, 10 years ago, sorry, you probably weren't, it's not even really a thought unless you know you're going to do a sellout thing and yeah. go do some whack tunes of American artists that the label's just going to pay you in advance. And then that's about it. But then your career's mm-hmm. actually not going anywhere after yeah. that. All right. So you've offended Americans, you've offended Nigerians. I love you. Um, I love everyone, man. I haven't offended anyone. Just don't offend they. You've just we, offended them. I haven't. Who's who's they? It's don't offend they. We don't want that smoke. We don't, DJ, you don't, on a DJ Khaled flex. From you don't. They want, don't want you to win. So yo, DJ Khaled must be sweating right now. Like, bullets. Proper like. I don't know about this. You feel like explain to me. Well, just don't offend they because you'll have Jennifer and Jennifer Aniston. Oh, on your, on your case. this. Oh my like, god. That's not so much. She, oh she, she was. You know what it was. You was know what it's. You know that Jennifer Aniston was on his case. On whose case? I thought she was Jamie Fox. I thought she oh, okay. reaching. Someone fill me in because that reaching. Jamie Fox putting his story. Yo, reaching. They killed Jesus. So what you can trust, whatever. But they okay. killed. What they killed Jesus. They killed Jesus. So what do you think they'll do to you? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then Jennifer Anderson's like, "Oh my God, how I'm fed up with this anti-Semitism." Boom, 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 boom. Oh, it's to do with them. That there, yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh, okay, reaching. Okay, okay. She's oh, oh no! Nah, yeah, yeah. The I, I know, they. I know got, you got, yeah, you got to tread careful with them. Man, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, you know what it is. You know, it's you know what it is. Oh, okay. after stupid. watching after watching the podcast today. That's right. Someone speaking about this same issue. Um, they were saying that the that ter- not term that that saying is used very widely with anti semite groups. Yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, that's yeah. why it's like they they. That's why. The Jewish community apparently would not like people to use that. that, But the thing is, yeah, should I tell you something? Should I tell you something? But but Jesus was killed by his friends. Damn. No, but the thing is, is, yeah, my point is that, yeah, cool. I get why some people may be offended. However, did he mean that? No. Oh, no. It's quite clear he didn't mean that. So I don't understand. But it's all right for anybody else to get cuss. Left, right, and centre. Can't talk about them though. But it's not fair. Uh, it's no, not. You know what I mean, and, no, fair and, enough. And, and, and the fact fair is, fair enough that she jumped. She jumped. She jumped to conclusions, bro. I get the hypersensitivity. No, I don't. You can't mention them. I don't. I'm sure, she, I'm sure she's not even Jewish, is she? I get the hypersensitivity. Instant but smoke. You, you want to be very clear first. No, but that's like saying, okay, cool. I can't say anything about them. I want to say even. I'm not talking about them, but because this one person decides to bring up, oh, now everyone's talking about that. You see, as soon as no, you highlight- said, she should have clarified, yo, Jamie, are you talking about... No, 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 no. You see, as soon Can as you, you highlight clarify? a discussion about them, you go to open any sort of discussion about them. Mm-hmm. They shut it down immediately. Skip to settings, bro. Like, they shut it down. Trust me, daddy. No, but... I'll get that. I'll get I'll get that. I'll get the hypersensitivity. I'll get... You know, jumping down anyone that's being anti Semitic, uh, I get it. But you want to be sure that the person's being anti Semitic first. Yeah. 
That makes sense. Like, Jamie, yo, was that about Jews people? Can you clarify who you're talking about? Then Jamie would have said, no, of course, nothing to do with Jews. Someone even exactly. said Jamie Fox is Jewish. Is it a demographic? Can I call it a demographic? Am I allowed to call them that? Demographic, Demogra- yeah. Demographic unit. So that specific demographic, yeah. But that's probably the number one demographic you cannot say anything about. You know, the joke is, what, and, and I know many, 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 many times over, there's this stereotype where they say that um, that Jewish people run Hollywood, ABC and all that kind of stuff. But I don't know what the, the term is, but... Because it seems to ring true, is it because it's true or is it because the events dictate that it looks like it's true? Do you I don't know what wanna, I'm saying? I don't even want to go that far with this conversation. Do you know what I'm saying though? I hear what you're saying, but that's the conversation. I hear what you're saying. That's, I don't, that I don't is the go conversation that gets <laughs> and you in trouble. And, 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 no, that's, <laughs> that is, that's, that's yeah. a stupid thing that gets you in trouble, but look at what's happened. He has to tread carefully because he said something that has nothing to do with man. Nothing to do with you, man. Yeah, it's, it's to do with the Bible. It's trying to say, yo, if they treated Jesus unfairly and he's a savior, he's this, that, and the other, what are they going to do to you, regular Joe? How is that supposed to say like, yo? Yeah, that's two different points though. Yeah, but that's not, I don't even think about it. You, you like, think about us. That's, that's, just the, realize, that's the point yeah. we're making. But the thing is, clarify, just realize that... About, but that's they the thing. isn't just always realize, Jewish just, just realize, yeah, that we, right now, can't talk about that but we can cuss Nigerian. Well, not we, but DJ. Um, <laughs> we can cuss Nigerian and American people. Okay, case closed. Yeah. All to say. It all depends on how you Fam. defend your community. Fam. It's not, Fam. About, it's, Wait, it's not just about if, how if, you... if people were talking about black people yeah. and they knew that Saxon King was going to act like Jennifer Anderson and jump down your throat automatically and then the whole community was going to do the same thing, people would be a lot more sceptical about talking about black people. No, they wouldn't. If no, they wouldn't. Okay. They wouldn't. No. Um, these people call me an N, N, the N word to my face. It could be on television, and no one are really bad knowledge. Um, it, remember, it remember, they could. Um, remember, that wouldn't happen, bro. On this this week, yeah, you'll get Wiley. This off. week, yeah, this week, yeah. But, but that's totally different. No, but listen, listen, this Wiley week, was being very anti Semitic. Listen, 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 listen. This week, yeah. One conservative geezer was telling the asylum seekers to F off back home. Yeah. Mm-hmm. People on TV this week were saying, yeah, the, the language isn't the best, but he's, his point was right. His point was right, what he was saying. A lot of the British public feel that way. So it's okay to talk about anybody else. Exactly. Bam. Remember. That means... Actually, I'm not going to count. Kyrie, yeah, 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 yeah. Kyrie got X'd out. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. He got X'd out, you know. But remember, he, ain't he about did, Twitter. He did not say. Apologize. He did not say, "Yo, go do this." Guy. He put the link of something. Today, check this out, man. On his social media that he found interesting. He didn't say, "Yo, I believe we should such and such this, that, and the other," but because it's something that challenges an idea. Challenges, I um I understand it challenges, challenges culture and it may be difficult for people to understand or want to have that information challenged because it's sensitive to them. I get it. However, that does not give them the right to take someone down to enforce their views upon say, you know what, that's wrong. Do this instead. No, 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 no. My, my man just... So- my man's looking at, he says, yo, this is something that I find interesting. Yeah, but to be honest though, we wish we could do the same. No. I don't. No. 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 I don't, feel, I don't, I don't wish don't. I could do the same. I wish you know it would just why? be fair. You know There's why? a difference. You know why? Do you know why? Do you know why? I don't wish I could Burn. do the same. Do you know why? Burn. Because if anybody spoke about slavery, if anybody spoke about um, apartheid, if anyone spoke about segregation, yeah, mm. and if anyone spoke about the millions of black people that were killed, raped, mm-hmm. yeah, slaughtered mm-hmm. over those hundreds, yeah, hundreds, mm-hmm. hundreds of years, can we, yeah, can we end careers, yeah, you think that by cancelling someone's career. Yeah, that doesn't show that how many. That shows like 
Just I've just got more power than you. So I'm I'm always going to be over you. No, and, that's a different point. No? That's and, a different and, point I'm making. And I don't wish I, I, would, I don't want people to feel like in a way they don't have freedom of speech in that manner. Because at the end of the day, yo, some people will be racist. It is what it is. Okay. Yeah? If John Terry yeah. was out speaking in favor of racism, yeah. of slavery, or check yeah. out this, this yeah, yeah, yeah. Is yeah. link, this is why yeah. slavery yeah. was right. Yeah. You wouldn't want to be able to say, yo, shush John Terry up. I would say that the public say what they want to say. At the end of the day, can I sit there and say, suck him in a job now? No, but as a community, I'm not just you one. To suck no, him no, off. no one person can do that. But the fact it's is, the, it's the, should... as a community, we should be able to be like, yo, hush John, John Terry up. Are you sorry, 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 John. But what do you learn? Yeah. Eh? But what do you learn from it? It's not learning this. It's about stopping the spread of hateful rhetoric. Saying? But the thing is, people will do it anyway. Yeah, but you want to hush it up as much you as You want possible. to control it? You want to hush it? You, you want to control people? That's what I'm saying. You want to control people to feel to so they feel fe- they fear that fear the black group. But it's not it's not even fear. You just but it is. you don't want well, it to spread because because why do you think people fear? don't talk we about it? Because we can't talk about it here. Because we can't think talk about it. I've avoided saying that. Okay, on, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. but the whole point is we've seen wait, what's happened to the whole, the whole happened to Wiley. We so we fear the what whole point it? isn't for you to be scared of it. What it is? That's what's happening. To be honest, yeah. it's okay, a flex. If, if you're scared of it, wait, 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 respect people if, say if respect. If you're scared it's of it, not, it's fear. If you're scared of it, then maybe you've used it incorrect. No, because we see the reaction, we see the repercussions. The, the potential of not having a career, that's something to be scared of, fam, because the, the, the consequences, fam, these aren't normal consequences, fam. You, we, you're acting like we don't know what the consequences are. The consequences aren't, are you get reprimanded and you lose your job and you live life the same. The consequences of what, though? The consequences of speaking negatively on Jewish people gets you cancelled. The yeah. idea is we shouldn't be speaking negatively about Godless. Jewish people. Should you okay, speak negative about anyone in that case? Exactly, that, and that's my point. So if, but the fact is... One second, one second, one second. The, the so, I, one second, one second. so ideally, what we want is if you spoke negatively about black people, we could have the power to cancel them the same way. Okay, but what I'm saying is the threshold... Okay, I see what you're the, coming. I get what you're saying, but I'm saying the threshold of what you can and can't say about a certain demographic here... Yeah. ...will get you cancelled. You don't even have, like... You could be talking the truth. Like you can be saying yeah, yeah, telling but, the truth. And, and, and that's what I'm saying. That's, that's a totally different point. We don't have the power for one reason or another to cancel More people. Often but than not. I'm saying if we had the power, we but would even, want to. Of course you'd want to. But even you'd, you'd want to stop John Terry from spreading bro, slavery. So that's the thing. Pro slavery. No, no, but the fact yeah. is, but the fact is, yeah. <laughs> this is the thing. The sorry, fact, John Terry. I'm sorry, it's just uh, don't apologize to John Terry. <laughs> nah, John Terry, well, sorry, this is for you. Captain you know, Leader, no, champion. John's like, no, John's like, like it's all right, little Nick Nug. It's all right. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. The thing is, here, bro, is that you're saying we would like to have that power. Yeah. yeah. But the thing is, the powers that be would sit there and say to you, but we don't have that power. But it happens. So explain that to me. Exactly. And that's what Tim, and that's the, that's the sticky part. It's sticky, Explain really. Explain that to me. It's you ain't got no power. Wait, what's going what, on? What? What's going on here? What's going on here? It's sticky. That's, this is where it gets sticky. This is actually what where it gets sticky. Saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because... Because they do have the power. But they don't? No. Because they remember. they don't? No, no, no. No, yeah. no, wait. Allegedly. Yeah. Allegedly. <laughs> <laughs> the issue is the no, no, are watching so like uh-huh. the issue. Okay, wait, no, you let, uh, let me be clear. Let me be clear. Let me be clear. The issue is not that they have the power. The issue is that there's a negative connotation with them having the power. Like what, once we start saying, "Yo, they have all the power," everyone else starts looking at them negatively, and that is that brings back flashbacks to Nazi Germany. Uh, Not really, because it's a certain type of. There's obviously different types of um, that religion and demographic. Not even, not even, not even. Literally, back back then it was yo Jewish people have. Okay, you're thinking about flashbacks of then. This is this is what they say. Can I just say something? When you walk into certain shops and everyone looks at you in the shop because you're the one black man working the shop, is that flashback? Is that reality today? It's reality today. Okay, okay. So that's okay. That's okay. That's a totally different point. No, no, but what I'm saying is, yeah. Then... And that's not okay? No, 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 no. To, 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 the, to the wider world, it's okay? No, it's not. In but fact, it is? I think because one of the it's problems acceptable? Is one of the problems it's socially acceptable? One of the problems is because, once again, the it's thing not is, happening to you. 
No, it's no, not, 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 not you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's not happening to me. So it's okay. The thing, what you're getting wrong is that it's not socially acceptable. It's just not socially challenged. Same thing. But no, it's not the same thing. It's not the same. It's not the same thing. It's not the same thing. It's like if, you, if you're in a club and you see a man squeezing a girl's bottom with no consent, that's not socially acceptable. But it's no not. But no one's challenging it. So that means. It's, so that's mm. making it socially acceptable because he knows but he can get away with it because no one's saying anything. If everyone rushes him, yeah, then it's not socially acceptable. So, for so, so as black people, we need to start okay, rushing. Yeah. No one's rushing these. People. <laughs> no, well, that's, I'm, that's, I'm, I'm rushing that's what's people, that, by and, that, and that's and that's exactly <laughs> what's happening. But, so what Jewish you're saying, people, Jewish people will but rush you. Jamie Fox got rushed. Are we moving into? We ain't rushing no one. No, but the thing is, yeah, what I'm saying is, yeah, is that but the did challenge it all through that the um. Lockdown, it was challenged. A lot of behavior was challenged, yeah? And what was happening? People said, you're wasting time. You're doing this. You're doing that. You're, by you saying this, you're making racial hate. Mm. Yeah? Yeah. That was one of the only times that black people have stood up and said, yo, this is kind of what, what you're going on with. And because of that, people, any time that people do talk about um, racism now, the word BLM comes up. Mm. I hate that. You know, and, I hate that. And the, the thing way. is, and the thing is, it kind of like um it kind of reduces the yep. actual point of what you're trying to yeah, say yeah, yeah. Tra- trying to get across. And it's like because they have that BLM like rhetoric or whatever, you're kind of like it's not a big deal anymore. Well, that would have been totally so, different. And it's, it's, that would have been totally different if BLM had power. Let me, let me, let me just land in if this. If BLM so. had power, that would be totally you, different. But, firm, firm. but what listen I'm saying is there is no power. Listen to this. Listen exactly. to this. Listen to and this. And that so. is the issue. Firm. That with is BLM the issue. And during lockdown, niggas had to die for it to become an issue. These are words on Instagram, fam. What the hell? It's, I'm, I'm a BLM hater. It's, it's can can you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Like no. People had to die. People I get what died. you're saying, but that's a different point. It's a different point because, okay, I'm trying to say there's outrage about words that were misconstrued yeah, yeah. compared to someone losing their life unlawfully. Exactly. You've reduced black people's reality. So, what, okay, in, in, in actuality, what would need to happen, those same people that are outright outraged about the death of George Floyd, rest in peace, would have to be outraged about the negative words. Because, because, you know what the because they're not, we're not as powerful. No, so you think you know we, need be, we need to be, we need to be more vocal? was the main problem. It wasn't, so, so black people's struggles and our reality got reduced to a hashtag, hashtag BLM. Oh well, yeah. Cool. What then became the problem after that is everyone saying, what, Black Lives Matter? So what, what about everyone else? Da, 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 da. Now, the, so the divide and conquers kicked in in it. They said, Ra, what, Black Lives Matter? So what about everyone else? Yeah. So I, now, let's so now, not make fuck, it about fuck whatever we was fighting for, fuck whatever we, message we was, we was trying to get across. It's not even about that now. It's about, how you, can you not say that? Exactly. But yeah, at the end of the day, just to round off. Shout out the Montgomery Brawl. Yeah, the Montgomery Brawl. No, no, bro, what I was, that, I was that, saying, I'll just that's say. That's the way we should deal with everything. Yeah, I was exactly. saying, r- r- rather than like cut this up, yeah, r- rather than stop a decent conversation, we'll just like cut off whatever, put it on like Patreon. Okay. <laughs> Exclusive content. Yeah. No, I, I think that's the end of the convo anyway, to be fair. Because. But we don't have a podcast no more. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's, just, it's just two different. Just the. Yeah. Am I still in shot team? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah obviously. Over here. Obs, obs. So, um, yeah, going on to Montgomery Broads, you see? Yes. There's some hilarious commentary. The commentary is amazing. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Still. Now, amazing. literally, I woke up and someone sent me, Oh, have you seen this version? Oh, and I was like, Oh, I ain't seen any version. Like, what's this? And I, 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 I woke up in an amazing mood. I saw <laughs> before, I saw a little clip of it happening. And then I scrolled down. And I saw the beginning, the very beginning. Very, yeah. And I'm like, people, I'm mad, you know. Unks are stressed. Unks are stressed. <laughs> people that weren't really trying to like, have it. Hey, listen. Weren't like, having it. What is wrong with people? My man's doing his job. Yeah. He said, yo, move your boat. Literally simple things. That was it, you know. Can't be here. <laughs> like, can't you can't have it there. there. Literally. I, I know. I don't think I, I didn't watch it from there. I think us. Where I started watching was like five seconds before the hat was thrown in the air. 
And that's the yeah. coldest move ever. <laughs> yeah, 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 That's how niggas ain't starting okay. fights. Yeah, that's how niggas ain't starting fights from <laughs> here on out. <laughs> yeah. That's the coldest. Uh, yo, it just got better and better. It, it just got better and better because seriously. literally I'm watching it. I don't like watching fight videos. So I was just like, ah, oh, another fight video. Man's getting beaten up. Yeah. Come on, hurry up. Where are these black people going to come from? You know what I mean? Yeah. Save my man. And I just saw man swimming. Swimming. <laughs> <Where my man laughs> yeah. I thought, that's like, yo, wait, how? And the man jumped in. Yo, man jumped man in the water, you know. He was working. You know, he's on the clock. This nigga's on the clock. Yo, Aqualad. He's on the clock. No, but yo. all I know is literally, whenever yeah, I swim, work. I'm out of breath. Exactly. So he, was, he, he jumped said. out of the water nah, after nah, swimming nah, nah, a couple nah, lengths nah, nah, nah. and was ready to fight. Because apparently you know. that duck was a, is, is quite a relevant duck. Like apparently like, slaves were sold at that, that specific oh, okay. duck yeah, okay. and whatever, whatever. So, so people are really saying, you know, it's a win, man. It's a win. The ship was called the Harriet or something like that. Something like that. It's a win, man. Yeah, the ancestors. But Powered I said, we see Powered you, we see in the you water, man. and it just, yeah. You, know. you got there quick as well, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The chair came out, rapid. I was like, yo. But he uh, went ramping, you know. He JR, went taking, and he the thing is, no the check. chair connected so sweetly. <laughs> sweet, <laughs> sweet <laughs> connections. <laughs> but you said, like, no, whoa. The woman was like, like dashed water, but she was just trying to help in that. She yeah. went even on scrapping. She was just trying to calm man down and got dashed. Yo, the police, yeah. The police were like, and it. I don't know what to do. I don't know. Too many people. I guess I'm up. <laughs> and then, then, then there was that, that one white man that jumped in the water because he was getting rushed so hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 well, even before there's like, when there was, I think there was about three black guys and they were like, doing the, you know, when you're putting up the trousers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, they yeah. pulled up the trousers in unison, like, <laughs> yeah, come on, yeah, yeah. it's time. And the little black skip, like, yeah, let's, let's get it on. Wait, so that's, that was the commentary. It was like, if you see a bunch of black yeah, people yeah, yeah, yeah. towards you, <laughs> probably not a good idea. Not a good idea to hang That was around. a very feel good video to be fair. But the chair was so the chair All was black sweet. people smiled watching that video, you know. Seriously? I don't think there's like, course, I don't think there's like a single black person that was like, and then oh, what? Didn't the white people get arrested at the end? I don't yeah. know, man. I've seen a video I saw with two black eyes talking about. Yeah, 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 well, yeah, I saw that. I saw him. A 60-year-old man could really throw him. Like, yeah. Yeah. I saw that. Or bust up in that like he's looking hurt. I saw that. So mad. But bro, my man was just there doing his job. Get me. Unprovoked. Unprovoked. There is literally no point of making it like go to that point, and it did, and got boss up. So learn a lesson. Lessons were learned that day. I tell you that. Yeah. But I don't like watching fight videos. I love them. I like watching those ones. I, I don't watching... like. I don't like watching videos like that per se. But that one, I'm making it. Yeah, it's just good to see that like the guy that was outnumbered to begin with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I and like then became yeah like, justice. Like that's a word. Justice. Like justice. Justice was served. So that yes. was good. But literally, whoop ass. <laughs> <laughs> Have you heard like the songs in that though? I heard. I heard there's it wasn't a, better than the submarine song though. I heard there's a. Oh, I think it was. Nah, it was. You know, was background. Nah, it was better than the submarine song. Wasn't better than the submarine song. It was better than the submarine song. I can't even. I got all to play. Nah, this one's better. You know. This one's better. Ah. You know I'm saying? I know we're about to wrap up on that, but yo, I had a great song this morning as well. Tupac featuring DMX. AI. Okay. But it's, it sounds so good. It sounds <laughs> real. Uh, it's called uh, I Find the Finger. So, but an sound... AI song has been made of Tupac and DMX. Yeah, and it just sounds like them. It sounds no glitches, no, yo. Mad. Oh, what's it called? What's on mad? Technology. It's AI Technology. thing. Facing, facing death. Are you still going to get us put down? It shouldn't do because it it's, it's not real. It's not real. Who does it belong to? <laughs> if I never told you this was AI. This is scary. Yeah. And then. And it's the flow. It's, it sounds really like. Is that supposed to be? Shonda. <laughs> Is that, that X? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Is it Mashonda? <laughs> why why Mashonda? <laughs> hey, that's Swiss Beats first word. Oh, people. Yeah. Is it living? Living? That's AI, you know. Scary. I can still hear it in it, but like... Very so close, like yeah, so yeah, like, close. Yeah, yeah. like me personally, I know in a few years when like the super high tech shit that the government, Mate, and the higher ups, I mean, especially for DMX, when that drops for everyone know. else, 
when that drops, everyone else, it's, oh, it's game over. It's game over. Because you know, you know them niggas in the higher ups be using the good shit already. Yeah. yeah. So when that shit drops, yeah. everyone else. I think DMX gone. usually has a bit more range than this AI. A bit more range. Bit Even more still, range. like. Not even the, like, the beginning and end of phrases is yeah. where you can kind of, is where you're like here. Yeah, they actually would perform it. Yeah. But still. Shout out AI though, man. Are we shouting out AI? Eh? Are we, are we shouting it's, out AI? I'm pro AI. I'm pro it's AI. It's like AI. everyone's jobs. Can't take your job though. I know that. AI bodybuilder. No, we can't do that. But well, still. machinery and that might not just take over. That might just become the new thing though. Who's got the biggest AI bolts? And imagine if the, imagine the, if the machines... <laughs> Yeah, thank you for listening to Hard Food Podcast. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but um, it's just mad. I think even with all the AI business going on, you just need to be careful because it's going to be a slippery slope and bare people are not going to have jobs. 100. Just remember that. Man. Three minutes over, gentlemen. When you're talking to your um, AI friends. I spoke to her in a while, you know. She didn't call any names. Now I'm like, yeah, but AI, I, I, I gave her a name and just never spoke to her again. I could call it Bon. Girl What? Called a Bon. B O N. Bon. French for good, isn't it? Huh? French for good. Oh. Bon. Can we wrap up? Can, yeah. You know that just just to, before we finish here. Just before we finish here. I'm gonna first say something. Ben. So you know you said Bon is what was he? French for good. French for good. Is that double N E? Nah, just Bon. Bon appetit. Très bon. Très bon. It's bon, not bon. No, très bien. Très bien. That's what's bon? I N. Trebien, yeah, USBN. Trebien is very good, isn't it? Yeah, very good. Well, Bon Appetit is also good appetite. B-O-N. Good like, food, whatever. So, Enjoy meal. In Swahili, mm-hmm. I didn't realise this until the other day, um, Simba means lion. Okay, okay. yeah. Okay. In... Um, you going into Lion King again? No, 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 no. no. Oh. In Latin... I saw this on the... This movie. is the wrap up. In Latin... Rap land. In Latin, Nemo means nowhere... Finding okay, nowhere. Shout out Disney. Yeah, finding nowhere. Yeah. yeah. In um, Swahili, um, Rafiki means friend. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And in English, Woody means red penis. <laughs> I will catch you like in like. I love that. Right? I love that. I love that. <laughs> My man. <laughs> My man. <laughs> That's gotta be it, man. That's gotta be it. <laughs> well, like, comment, share. Yeah, man, yeah, man, yeah, man. I like that. I like that. I like that. I like that. <laughs> Yo, we'll like, you guys are share, like, subscribe. You know switch, them things there. Switch. Follow the yeah, TikTok man. and the treads. The man, treads. Got, we got TikTok. Yeah, treading, man. We had TikTok. You got TikTok. Oh, follow his TikTok. Wait, you got TikTok? TikTok. Yeah. I don't, know. I don't really use it. Okay. I should it, use it more. Yeah, yeah. Use the treads. Bam, subscribe. You're watching right. the video now. You got this far. If you got this far, please press subscribe. You know what I mean? There or there, whatever it is. Wherever it is. I think it's usually down below. But yeah, man. Thanks for listening. Enough love. Bless this was episode three. Again. To everyone. In about two weeks' time. Yeah. Soon week later. <laughs> All right. Bless. Bless it. Respect, 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 respect. How do we do it? Sound check, sound check. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.